Hello everyone, this is Nicole from All to New. Thank you so much for joining me. In this video, I'm going to walk you through how you can stamp different layers together using our Build of Flower Bella Roma Hybrid Tea Rose stamp set. This is a stamp set that you see right here, and then the packaging includes a layering guide. So make sure to refer to our trifold packaging that is coming with your stamp set package. This is a great way for you to understand how to layer these images up when you're working on these alone. So let's start with our flower image first, and I'm going to start with outline image using jet black ink and stamp that onto a cardstock. Notice the different grooves and the valleys that you can see on the outline stamp. The first one, you'll ink it up with the lightest shade. I am using sea glass ink pad here, and you're going to fit those shape within the outline and stamp that. Second layer, I'll be using dusk ink pad, and then these are supposed to go to the outer edges of the flower and these fit within the grooves within the outline as well. So line those up and stamp it. Third one is a little tricky. I'm going to point out where you need to match up the images. So focus on the center left and then the top center. There is a groove on the bottom portion of the stamp that you need to match up using the center left matching point. I inked this up with a Desert Night ink pad and stamped it. This is the darkest color of the family. Now let's move on to the leaves. Leaves are pretty straightforward. You're going to stamp the outline with jet black and then I am using limeade and lime color to stamp the layers for the leaf. There is a solid layer and then a partial layer. And you're going to line this up using the outline for the solid image. And then for the partial one, you'll focus on the center portion of the leaf cluster image here. These images are really great for layering up the uh, different images in the same tone or a completely different tone for you to create contrast. So these are designed to be either worked great in monochrome tone or in a very different contrasting tone. So it is completely up to you how you want to ink these up, but hopefully this guide was helpful. Thank you so much for joining me and let us know if you have any questions by emailing us at support at Thank you so much for watching.